pause the video now if you wish to solve it. Keep watching the video once ready. Suppose this expression has a value, we can let it to be x. And what we can see here is, if this is x, whatever here, is repeat again. So, we will have x equals to square root of 2008 plus 2007 and whatever here it is x. So, multiply with x. Now, we can do this with the assumption that this expression has a value. So, after we have this, x squared will be equal to 2008 plus 2007 x. Now, we get quadratic expression. So, x squared minus 2007x minus 2008 equals to 0. We factorize it. And we have x equals to 2008 or... Now, note that what is x? x is a square root of the whole thing. So, this must be greater or equal to 0. So, if x equals to negative 1, it has to be rejected. And therefore, the answer is x equals to 2008. And that is for question 5. So, this is question 6. We are asked to find the possible x, y, z. Pause the video now if you wish to solve it. Keep watching the video once ready. From this, we'll get 1 plus 9x squared over 9x squared equals to 2 over 3y. Then from here, 1 over 9y squared plus 1 will equal to 2 over 3y. Similarly, from second and third one, 1 over 9y squared plus 1 equals to 2 over 3z. And 1 over 9z squared plus 1 equals to 2 over 3x. This is not equation. It's equivalent to this equation. Now, after we have this, we will let a to be 1 over 3x, b equals to 1 over 3y, and c equals to 1 over 3z. So this will be equals to a square plus 1 equals to 2b. And for this, um, b square plus 1 will equals to 2c. And the last one, c squared plus 1 will equal to 2, 8. After we have this, we sum up everything here. We will have a squared plus 1, plus b squared plus 1, plus c squared plus 1, minus 2b, minus 2c, minus 2a equals to 0. In this case, we can complete the square here. This will give you a minus 1 squared, and this will give you b minus 1 squared, and the last one will give you c minus 1 squared. Uh, in the question, it says that x, y, z are real numbers. Okay? If x, y, z are real numbers, a, b, c will be a real numbers. So if this is true, if and only if, a equals to b equals to c equals to 1. Then x equals to y equals to z equals to 1 over 3. <laughs>